Tiga. Assalamualaikum. We would like to present our assignment. ESC ESC five five one. MATLAB execution. My name is Muhammad Fuad bin Muhammad Nur Azmin, and this is my partner. So my name is Yang uh, Mustaqim bin Muhammad. So let's get started. Assalamualaikum. Today we are going to present our assignment ESE 551 Task 2 MATLAB Execution For question A We need to find the break in breakaway point Imaginary axis crossing Angle of departure Angle of arrival And then we need to find the value of K And need to know uh, Either the system the system is stable or not okay first thing first we need to write this command in the comma window so this is the value of numerator and this is uh, the value of denominator after we get the transfer function we need to write uh, r locus g command into the comma window to get the uh, root locus of the system ok now this is the root locus of the system here we got uh, 3 pole from the task 1 we get the value of k is 30 for the task 2 we need to <coughs> We need to find the value of k in the MATLAB to to get the value of k we need to drag the point until until we get the value is near to 30 <coughs> for the breakaway point uh, in this root locus <coughs> the value is located at negative 0 0.473 since there are no poles on imaginary axis so there is no angle of departure and angle of arrival all the pole is located at at left hand side so the system is stable for the question 2b we need to assess whether the point uh, this point is located on the root locus of the system uh, then we need to find the settling time, peak time and percentage overshoot at the step response so first thing we need to use again this command uh, and, but this time we use the command CSO2G in the comma window to get the root locus and step response of the system. Okay. Uh, now, after we get the root locus, we need to drag this point until it reach uh, this point negative 0.10. One, one, one. To get the point S Negative 0, 1, 7 Plus J, 1.74 We need to adjust the pole Until the peak amplitude Reach 1.74 From the graph We can get the the value of settling time uh, 26.3 second and the uh, TP peak amplitude 1.74 and the percentage overshoot 74.2 for question 2C we need to prove that the Design lead capacitor in task 1 has met the criteria. If not, we need to adjust the capacitor gain, pole and zero to achieve the desired criteria. And to add the lead capacitor, we just need to right click the uh, 
uh, add root locus and then we click the edit compensator to add the lead compensator so this is the lead uh, the root locus after we add uh, lead compensator so this is the compensator editor that we add here the lead compensator and then we adjust at the root locus to get the percentage overshoot that we want which is 15% uh, we also get the setting time uh, at 2.83 second and the peak amplitude uh, is 1.15 for question 2D we need to prove uh, lead compensator uh, has met the criteria if not we need to adjust the compensator gain pole and zero to achieve the desired criteria Okay, uh, to find the step, the offset overshoot uh, at twenty percent, we just need to adjust the point at root locus until it get twenty uh, percent overshoot. Uh, so the from the step response, we know that the TS is equal to 10 second and TP is 1.2 for the gain if the criteria is not met that which is uh, 15 dB we need to adjust the gain until it, it becomes uh, 15 dB so we, we got the phase margin which is 48 degree thank you that's all for us thank you